Murphy. Short. Rebound on seal. Holmes running the floor! Whoa! Yeah. Kobe Brea comes up to get it. Sophomore from Washington Heights, New York, with the post entry for Kamara. He's got the size mismatch on Storm Murphy and a block by Gasson. Especially for a young team, I think it's important for them to get engaged and dialed in defensively, especially early on. There it is. Holmes the put back over Mutz. Whitney. Ooh, he was thinking yeah, about another Natalie voice and hits. Aluma's bucket was his first points, 19 minutes in, and he finds Gasson, who's got a chance at three. Final seconds, Aluma answers for Virginia Tech. And that does it for the first half here at UD Arena. Just a great place for college basketball, man. I grew up watching, you know, high school playoff games, state championships in this building. There's a lot of history in here. Great inside pass to Holmes. He'll take that in. One. Just a great place for college basketball, man. I grew up watching, you know, high school playoff games, state championships in this building. There's a lot of history in here. Great inside pass to Holmes. He'll take that in. One. Season high 14 for the sophomore wing from Baltimore. And he's getting out and running. Blakeney can soar and he lays it in. Oklahoma just outside of Oklahoma City played very well off the bench against Cornell on Wednesday when he knocked down three threes and he buries one here. Aluma spinning on Amsil and finishing and it's a five point game. Two freshmen, two sophomores, and a senior. That's the five for Dayton. Blakeney off a jab step, hits another! What a day for R.J. Blakeney! Learning how to close out games. Alumino, Murphy Hoist, and hits! Much needed make for the Hokies. Still 40.6 to go. Final few seconds, Aleem can't get it to go, and Dayton defeats Virginia Tech here at home.